Okay, welcome to a noisy in my office tutorial. Um, this isn't hasn't really got anything to do with Blender. Um, you make morphs in Blender and you put them in here and then you want to move them to the iClone. So this was more of an animation question, uh, which is fine. I'm not going to do too many of them because I, it's it's a lot of everybody else is covering all that and it's this is more of a, a, a how to make stuff channel uh, instead of it's I don't know well I guess it covers animations or anyways I'll stop rambling um, there is one other tutorial I was gonna do on s sort of squash and stretch concept for uh, animating um, but I'll do this first <laughs> uh, so the idea here is to make this guy flex or something so the first thing you want to do is export um, a copy of this guy like this because this is gonna be what he's gonna start out like because I'm gonna I'm, I'm not changing him I, it's just a demo so I'll call him Mason 1 I exported him already um, now we will wait because this takes forever Okay, so the first one I'm going to make, um, uh, I don't know, uh, we'll make him a muscular, we'll do a full body, bodybuilder. There we go. Pretend he's being Superman. This doesn't look bodybuilder to me, but anyways, fitness, more fit. <laughs> I don't know. There we go. Okay. Uh, fitness, body tone more body tone more muscular I don't know that's fine there's one so I don't know let's say he's morphing into the Incredible Hulk or you see if I was doing if you wanted to do some custom morphs um, you'd simply make a morph in Blender and import it but we've already covered that so we'll just do that I, these are not good morphs because I don't use them anyways so here's uh, one morph we'll pretend uh, file export as an eye avatar and uh, fine we'll go to this one although we don't really need it so we'll say Mason muscular and we'll wait some more okay so that's one done now I'm gonna reset them again and uh, we'll do a face one um, face 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 cheek depth like you can actually make these more so we'll call that one uh, cheek sink uh, it's not gonna work cheek bones bulge cheek sink right and cheek sink left so that's pretty good so there he's puffing it's a little bit pronounced but anyways it's gonna show so we'll export this morph to eye avatar and I'll go to highest although they actually oh no they don't I thought they had increased that anyways never mind 
Or maybe it's just this Mason dude, because he's older, a bit older. The PBR might be higher. So Mason, Mason, puffy cheeks. And we'll wait for it to do it again. The reason why this is taking so long is it's taking all the information and smushing it together. And when the eye avatar goes in eye clone, there won't be parts to it anymore. It'll just be a continuous mesh with with the the only no moving parts that are morphable, other than the morphs that we're creating but we're exporting them as eye avatars. So there we'll go. So now we'll wait some more. <laughs> Okay, so now we'll go into iClone and import desktop. I put it under quickie tutorials. Um, Mason one. There's our Mason. So we're going to go in here. Um, now if I can remember, here it is, Morph Animator, Morph Creator. Oh, there it is, Just weird pause. Okay, so there he is. And what is that Alt-Z thing? Never mind. So we want to add morphs. Snook Daddy. Playing with everything all the time. Add morphs. Uh, desktop. Desktop. Quickie tutorials. Morph. They're muscular. Okay. This I overdid it. Anyways, never mind. Mason muscular. Oh, he looks fine. Okay, so that's one. So bake. This is a uh, Mason muscles. I'm gonna remove the source sliders. There we go. So there he goes. So there it's going up. They're linked now. So that's one. Show child morphs. There, so. so we only want this, right? We want the clothes to go. So the child morphs is that's what we want. Now we're gonna add Mason and his puffy cheeks. Wait a second. Yeah, fine. I'm gonna add another one. Mason and his puffy cheeks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mason muffle muscles. Uh, Mason muscles, Mason muscles. Mason puffy cheeks. There he goes. That's uh, one. And we'll bake that, and we'll call that uh, skinny puffy cheeks. I don't know. Create. Remove the source. Okay. So there we go. Mason muscles and Mason puffy cheeks. And. 
muscles, muscles, cheeks. I don't know. <laughs> there we go. Show child morphs. not what I wanted. Okay, whatever. Updated into iClone. Mason puffy cheeks. We have to do it again. Mason puffy cheeks. No muscle cheeks. There we go. Fake. Puff. Puffy cheeks. Great. Okay. There's that one. There, finally. Awesome. Okay. Updated into iClone. Um. Oh, I'm not quite sure about this part here. So, Morph Animator. There we go. Show Child Morphs. So, here we are. Mason Puffy with his muscles and his cheeks. I guess I didn't, I shouldn't have done, wait, let's make one more. Um, uh, add one more. Mason muscles. Okay. Um, there we go. Okay, there we go. That's good. Fine. Mason muscles. Ma Mason muscles. So as you can see, I haven't done this for a very long time. I did it once. Um, when uh, I was uh, testing it. That's it. So uh, that that's it. Morph animator. So there's our Morse, Mason Muscles, Puffy Cheeks, Mason Muscles and Puffy Cheeks. So we can shut this. Yeah, yeah. Uh, should be fine. Oops, that was dumb. Morph animator. This is what we want. So you want to make him puff his cheeks and whatever. So timeline. Start at 100. Well, 10, I guess. And we'll make him puff his cheeks. Uh, now, if I can remember how to do this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember how to do this. Oop. Where's Mason? Mason. There's one. Okay. Um, morph. There it is. That's one morph. the animator.
So there he is, puffing his cheeks. And the other one is Mason Muscles, insert keyframe. Mason Muscles. Insert a keyframe down there. Move another 10 Mason Muscles. Another 10. And I'll just copy these. And that's it. I mean, it's pretty much it. I'll loop it. That's an animation using the Morph Creator. And so you can do whatever you want with it. <laughs> I didn't put a keyframe in to stop him from puffing up slowly. But, uh, um, copy, paste, copy, paste, oops, should be a bit better. So then you just render it out if you were going to make a movie. So that's the end of that. Have fun. Bye for now. <laughs>